Hey everyone and welcome to Top Think. Today we're going to learn about 10 signs of an immature person. Now, let's begin. Number 1. Irresponsible spending Do you know someone who buys expensive things without thinking? Someone who throws away thousands of dollars they don't have? Irresponsible spending is a very common sign of immaturity. More often than not, immature people don't understand how to take responsibility for their actions. They rarely process the consequences of their decisions, acting solely on their emotions and their careless desires. All right, let's say you see an expensive gold watch in the window of a store. Now, as a mature person, you'd check the price, think through your purchase, and then decide whether the watch is actually worth the money. But an immature person, on the other hand, would find themselves blinded by their excitement. They'd whip out their credit card without even thinking, spending loads of money that they just don't have. Immature people take and take and take without realizing how much damage they're doing. Part of growing up is learning when to splurge and when to hold back. It's controlling your wants, wishes, and desires until you have the stability to act on them. Now, this may take a few weeks, a few months, or even a few years, but mature people know how to be patient. So if you know someone who makes irresponsible financial decisions, eh, chances are they're emotionally immature. Number 2. Petty Insults Yeah, there's nothing more frustrating than arguing with an immature person. Instead of exploring their points, challenging your ideas, or changing their perspective, immature people argue with personal attacks. Their grasp on the argument itself slips away as they resort to petty insults and unnecessary criticism. Just imagine you're arguing with an immature friend about something simple, like the weather. You like cold weather, they like hot weather. So you prove your point with examples, like the snow in the trees or warm mugs of hot chocolate. But your friend says something like, Oh, you'd have to be stupid to think cold weather's better than hot weather. This is a really mild example, but notice how your friend stopped arguing his own points and started attacking your character. When immature people get frustrated, this is what they do. They try to force their opinions on you by critiquing your intelligence, your strength, or your integrity. In the moment, they may not even realize what they're doing. They're so blinded by their stubborn desire to win, they'll say anything to make it happen. So what do you do in these situations? What should you say when an immature person starts attacking you personally? Well, you don't have to say anything. The worst thing you can do is fight back or try to prove an immature person wrong. When an immature person insults you, just ignore them. Number 3. Zero Impulse Control Immature people struggle to control their impulses. On top of their irresponsible decision-making, immature people act without thinking of anyone but themselves. They just blurt out things that are completely inappropriate. They get swept away in the excitement of the moment, paying little attention to where they are or who they're with. Immature people are careless and rude, in the same way a child offends people without even realizing it. But unlike a child, immature adults should know better. Maturity means stepping outside of yourself and gaining some perspective. It means controlling your impulses, filtering your speech, and paying attention to the people in your environment. Every adult has the tools to control their impulsivity, but if they're immature, they're just not using them. Number 4. Bullying Others Bullies are immature people who lord over others, using the illusion of strength, success, or intelligence to attack someone they label inferior. It's no surprise that bullies are some of the most emotionally underdeveloped people in the world. They thrive in positions of power because that power inflates the ego and it covers up deep-rooted insecurities that may plague their inner lives. In other words, bullies attack others to feel better about themselves. And by lashing out, a bully smothers their problems with temporary feelings of power and confidence. Uh, but those feelings never last, and their insecurities come back stronger than ever. That's why adults, mature adults, confront their issues instead of simply feeding their egos. If you know someone who's constantly putting other people down to their face or behind their back, you know a bully. And that bully has a lot of growing up to do. Number 5. Poor listening skills. Do you know someone who talks but never listens? Do they tell long-winded stories but tune out the moment they stop talking? 
Immature people expect to get more respect than they give. They demand that other people listen closely to every word they say, but they couldn't care less what others are saying to them. Well, why is that? Because they don't have the emotional maturity to feel empathy. They aren't conscientious enough to look outside of themselves, to walk in another person's shoes. In fact, many immature people don't even bother to try. For some, poor listening skills fade with age, but others never realize anything's wrong. If their lack of empathy persists, immature people can become narcissistic. They become so preoccupied with their own personal bubble, they forget or simply don't care about anyone else. Mature adults, on the other hand, have empathy. While introspection is a valuable trait, you have to find a balance between your internal and external worlds. Otherwise, you fall into narcissistic patterns. You stop listening to the people around you, and you stop growing as a person. Number 6. Refusing to Apologize Immature people don't like admitting they're wrong. Instead of admitting their mistakes, immature people use every excuse in the book. They blame everyone but themselves because their fragile egos just can't handle the weight of even the tiniest failure. In other words, getting a simple apology from an immature person is an excruciating chore. All right, let's say your roommate forgets to wash the dishes. You've asked them a dozen times to wash their plates, but once again, you're staring at a sink full of dirty dishes. So if your roommate were mature, they would apologize and take responsibility for their failure. If they were immature, they would look for a way out. They would blame you for not reminding them to do the dishes, or they'd act like you're the crazy one for wanting the dishes washed. The truth is, your roommate is trying to protect their injured pride. Immature people feel better about themselves when someone else takes the blame. So don't be surprised if they refuse to apologize. Number 7. Attention Hogging Do you know someone who hogs the spotlight everywhere they go? Do they never feel like they're getting the attention they deserve? People who are immature need constant attention to nourish their self-esteem. They only feel secure and confident when they think the entire room is in their corner. But their attention-seeking behavior is not only frustrating for the people in their life, it's also detrimental to their own self-esteem. Immature people that depend on the attention of others rarely develop any genuine confidence or self-belief in the long run. As soon as the spotlight shines away from them, an immature person will get desperate. They may even resort to bullying and aggression just to reclaim the spotlight for themselves. Number 8. Lack of Support Immature people struggle to support or encourage others, even family, friends, and partners. Compliments are few and far between, while insults and criticisms fly freely. It may feel like this person is always pointing out your flaws and never recognizing your successes, because, well, that's exactly what they're doing. Immature people don't appreciate the success of others because it makes them feel worse about themselves. Because they're immature, they compare themselves to everyone for everything. Whenever you accomplish something, an immature person feels like they're falling behind. So instead of supporting you, they bring you back down to their level. Otherwise, you're better than them, and that's the last thing an immature person wants. So if you know someone who's emotionally immature, you may never hear a nice thing out of their mouth. Number 9. Rampant Lying Do you know someone who lies all the time? Immature people avoid the truth because the truth is often boring, uneventful, and plain. Immature people seek attention, so the stories they tell exaggerate the truth, making them seem cooler, smarter, or more accomplished than they actually are. Immature people lie to build their image, even though the truth is far less fantastic. Mature adults know there's nothing wrong with the boring, uneventful truth. You're defined by the facts of your life, not the crazy stories that you make up about yourself. You can pretend you're a high-flying, accomplished individual, but if you have nothing real to show for it, well, it doesn't matter what stories you tell. Number 10. Redundant Mistakes Immature people have the same issues over and over again. Even if they recognize the error in their ways, they fall into the exact same traps. They get derailed again and again no matter how many times you tell them not to. Why is that? Because immature people don't learn from their mistakes. They defend their failures in order to save their pride and preserve their ego. 
And for the same reason they don't apologize, immature people don't admit that their mistakes were actually mistakes. So when they run into a similar situation, they fail all over again. Mature people, on the other hand, learn from their failures. No one's immune to making mistakes. No matter how wise or mature you are, there will be times when you slip up. What matters is that you reflect, identify your mistakes, and learn from them. Mature people figure out when something's wrong, and they make an effort to fix it. Hey, thank you for watching Top Think, and be sure to subscribe, because more incredible content is on the way.